chronic disease which is associated with multiple etiologic factors and not only one factor can be best explained by now uh, chronic diseases for example the car cardiovascular disease or many other diseases which are chronic in nature cannot be explained by a single etiologic factors and there is a uh, basically web of the interaction of multiple factors okay which interact with each other each other and they lead to the chronic disease so uh, for example if i just try to make a thing that is stress now this stress can lead to high cholesterol level now this high cholesterol level right that can lead to again high blood pressure now this stress can be either due to insomnia it can be due to poor diet right this insomnia the poor diet right now due to stress the person can smoke and vice versa right now due to this smoking the person can again get insomnia now due to insomnia the person is unable to get the proper diet and he can have poor diet due to low economic status also low economy also the person can have poor diet again he might have stress and due to stress high cholesterol would be there high blood pressure will be there now same way due to all these due to the stress itself there can be development of diabetes right even due to poor diet there can be diabetes now due to these factors like high blood pressure diabetes high cholesterol there can be arterial stiffness and yes this is going to lead to cardio vascular disease so cardiovascular disease is a chronic disease and there is interlinking a lot of factors which are interlinked with each other and they lead to cardiovascular disease now there are certain important factors if we remove those okay in between which are known as the key factors also so you can stop the disease itself right so there is an interaction and if you see you must be uh, wondering that it's it has become a web and these are the etiologic factors so that is known as the web of position now this web of position this was a term that was coined by mac mohan and paul and it is applicable especially on the chronic disease where positive agents are unknown or uncertain and it is a interaction of multiple factors if you remove one of the factors even one of them some or even one of them if you say one of them that is known as the important link or the key factor and you can control the disease itself so this is basically the web of position and if we uh, just try to understand this particular question you will be directly getting the answer as the option 2 which is web of position generally seen in chronic disease where multiple etiological factors interact with, with each other and they lead to that chronic disease